do you also want the best FPS and no more room in hell? Then watch the video to the end, but before. First you need to go here, type check, press on check for updates. Here you can update your windows, just press on the install button and follow the steps to be up to date, then go here, type optimize, press on defragment and optimize drives. Select your C drive, then press here on optimize. Wait a few seconds. When it is done, go to the other drives you have, first press on analyze, then optimize. Now you need to have the ultimate performance guide on your PC, so go here, type CMD, right click on command prompt, and press on run as administrator. Then this page will pop up, here you have to paste a command, copy this command from my description, and just right click and paste it here, then press enter, and now you have the ultimate performance guide, but to activate it, you need to close the page, then go here, type choose, press on choose a power plan then you have to press on this arrow check ultimate performance now you have it activated go here type run press enter type temp press ok the temp folder is windows dump file location everything in this folder can be deleted and is not needed select everything from here and delete them then go here again type percent temp percent press ok the same delete everything from here go again here type prefetch press ok this data allows programs to open faster by storing data on the files location for quicker access in windows so select everything from here delete them then go here on the recycle bin right click on it press on empty recycle bin press yes and you are clean go here type graphics press on graphics settings Make sure you have this on, then press here on Browse. Search where you have your Steam folder. Double click on it. Go to Steam Apps. Then Common. And MRIH. Select this. Press here on Add. When you have this here, press on Options. Here check High Performance. Press on Save. Go back here to Settings Home. Go to Gaming. On the Xbox game bar, select this to off. Then on the game mode. Select this to on, for the optimization from graphic settings to work. Now right click on the screen, press on NVIDIA control panel. This page will pop up, go to adjust image settings with preview. Check use the advanced 3D image settings. Press apply. Then go here to manage 3D settings. Here we have to change some settings. On the low latency mode, select on OpenGL Rendering GPU. Select your video card. Power Management Mode. Select Prefer Maximum Performance. Texture Filtering Quality. Select High Performance. Threaded Optimization. Select on and Vertical Sync. Select off. Press on Apply. Then go here to adjust desktop color settings. Scroll down to Digital Vibrance. Move this to 70%. Press Apply. Close the page. Go here. Type this PC. Right click on it. Press on Properties. Here you have to go to Advanced System Settings. On the Advanced, under Performance, press here on Settings. Check Adjust for Best Performance. Then press here on Apply. OK. OK again. Close the page. Open the game. When you are here, press here on Options. This page will pop up. Here you have to go to Video. On the Resolution, select 1920 by 1080. Aspect Ratio. Select 16 by 9. Display Mode. Select Full Screen. Press on Adjust Brightness Levels. Select it by 2.2. Press OK. Then press on Advanced. On the Model Detail, Select Low. Water Detail. Select Simple Reflections. Texture Detail. Select Low. Shadow Detail. Select Low. Shader Detail. Select Low. Color Correction. Select Disabled. 
anti-aliasing mode, select none, filtering mode, select bilinear, wait for vertical sync, select disabled, motion blur, select disabled, field of view, drag it to the 75, multi-core rendering, select disabled, high dynamic range, select none, uncheck this, then press ok, press apply, ok, and enjoy the game, I hope you found this useful, don't forget to subscribe, see you in the next episode, bye.